everybody so I wanted to tell you guys about this conditioner I am using that I happen to really 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 love it's very simple really cheap and it's the swamp natural tropical coconut I love coconut I love the smell of coconut love the taste of coconut so this one is 30 fluent out 30 30 fluent ounces and I cannot find hold on I got okay a little this little disclaimer aside note here I'm house sitting this week so that's why I probably look really good on this camera. You can see stuff and all the blemishes on my face. Oh my gosh. But the camera is doing really weird and funky stuff. Like it goes back and it goes in. And I'm trying to get adjusted and used to this camera. So just kind of work with me. <laughs> Here, let's see this. Okay, this is odd. But Wall Naturals um, Conditioner. It's a tropical coconut. And I love it because it's great slip. Slip. <laughs> It has great slip to the conditioner um, and conditions my hair, leaves my hair feeling really soft and moisturized. There you go, now you can see it really well. Yeah! It leaves my hair feeling really soft and moisturized and conditioned and I don't have any problems with my hair um, as being getting dry. I co-wash my hair probably once a week, sometimes twice a week depending on what I'm doing with my hair, what my atmosphere is. I'm kind of like trying out this little, I'm playing around with different hairstyles with my hair in a spro, and then the camera's going back up again, I don't know what this camera's doing. There we go, okay. So I'm trying different stuff with my hair, um, I don't know what you call this, but we'll see how it goes. I was doing like a little faux pop thing, yeah, but anyway. So I love the Swallow Conditioner, I actually bought another one, and this is the same thing, but this is Wild Cherry Blossom, bam, you can see it together, Wild Cherry Blossom and then Tropical Coconut. This one's only 22.5 ounce, and this one's 30 um, ounces. The reason why I went and got another one, as you can see, I'm about done with this one, but I was looking for another one this size, but I couldn't find it anywhere at all. So I happened to go to um, Bed Bath and Beyond, and I saw this one. And guess how much it cost? Eighty-eight cents. Eighty-eight cents for a very good conditioner that has good stuff in it: vitamin E, water, all that good stuff. Yeah. Wow, well, sure. Well, actually, smells pretty good. It actually, smells pretty good. So I'm not mad at it. I'm just really used to getting everything coconut, but I do love this conditioner, and if you are starting out being natural, you should get this conditioner, yeah. I don't know what I'm saying, I'm just like really rambling right now. I haven't been on the camera for a while, I've been doing some stuff with Jocelyn with the Hannah videos, and been really busy with trying to find a job, and school, and family, and everything else that... I forgot how to stay focused on camera. Well, I'm not focused, period. Like, I lose my focus very easily. So I don't know how this video is going to turn out or even be, but I'm going to put it up on YouTube anyway. <laughs> because I ain't got nothing else. I ain't doing nothing. I ain't doing nothing, y'all. I said this morning, I watch Charm. I watch Will and Grace. I love Will and Grace. And I was also watching, um, what was my... What's my other show that I watch in the morning sometimes? Oh, Reba. I love me some Reba, y'all. Love Reba. But yeah. The conditioner. That's what the main focus of the video. The conditioner. There we go. This is really good conditioner. You start out being natural and you're hearing about this co wash and conditioner washing. I would definitely start using Swab Naturals. It will not bake your break your bank. Um it's very easy. You can pile on with other stuff. You can actually make perfume with this conditioner too. I've seen, what's her name? Gosh, she does the braiding and stuff. I'll put a link of the video somewhere up here. Maybe around that area. Um, the video where she makes a um, perfume spray and to use like some conditioner and some other stuff too as well. I have no problem using some leave-in. I don't pile it in my hair, but sometimes I'll rub a little bit in my hair and use a leave-in to help detangle and not wash it out. I don't have no problem with that. It works well with me and my hair. And that's it. I'm going to stop talking now. And see what
see what else I can figure out to put on YouTube today. <laughs> you guys have a great day!